Hello and welcome to your first C++ tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to build a calculator from scratch using code blocks and coding with C++ so let's go so in code blocks you just go and open code blocks and you get this you click create new project and then you click console application click go make sure it's on C++ and you can just name it any other color. One, two, three, because I already have one called Liam. Just save it wherever you want. Just like click that. So bring that up. Click next. And they should be on this by default. If it's not, then make sure it is. Then click finish. And then you get this. And then on the left, you see your workspace. Double click main. And you've got this, you've got like a simple program, and this here is build and run. Click that to build it and open it, and then I'll open the program. And then, as I'm recording, it might be a bit slow, but yeah, we'll just come on, hurry up. Alright, let's just change this. All right. So yeah, it says hello world. That's pretty much what means print out on the screen. Ah, so we'll take that out and then we'll use integers. We'll type in int a and then int b and then int answer equals a plus b. Then after that you put type in c out and last time last time sign speech marks um and then just type like enter your first number backslash backslash and line this means end line here yeah. there's a list like to take this to a new line and you type in like cn greater and greater and that means um type in like input and then type a and a little semicolon is it? That's like the M and the line. You have to have one after every line. So you type in your first number, and then you type, you type in ten, and then you do C out again, and then say enter your second number. Same again. You do C in, and then B, and then after that. Um, you do C out, less than, less than, and then A plus B, so I go run, and then save that, click build and run, and what that does, it's all opening up, so it says, enter your first number, so I'll do 10, and enter your second number, so just make a simple 1, then your answer is 11. But I'm gonna try something here. Right. Your the right, it will say answer is oh, um the sum of those numbers is and then we'll do that in um I'm just trying this, I don't know if it's gonna work, if it doesn't then. Oh well. I'll click build and run. Try it now. And so 10 plus 1. So if those numbers is okay. Did it work? Okay, so that didn't work, but I'll just try that and I'll try and build that in a different tutorial, but as you can see, so what I've got is integer A is the first number, and then integer B is your second number, and then integer answer is your first number plus your second number. So you've got um, print out on the screen, so this means print out into your first number. And then 
on a new line you can type in your first number then it'll print out once you've typed in your first number it'll say it'll print out on the screen enter your second number then end line and then on the new line you can type in your second number which is B and then it'll print out on the screen A plus B which is the two numbers added together and make sure this return zero is here as well that just pretty much means return zero errors and we'll just try it again 10 plus 100 equals 110 um, and another way to do um, the end line is you could do this backslash n backslash n save that and then we go ten and oh shit sorry ten plus ten is twenty no we can't have it there backslash n backslash n I think that'll work I'm not sure no okay that's just basic tutorial not to work a calculator so i hope you enjoyed and yeah there's all the code uh, peace